<laughs> Ew! Ew! Like <laughs> Ew dude. Oh my god, man! Hey, bro. hey, wow! Who's who's making farts this early in the morning? Everybody is. It's Friday, August twelfth. It's the Fink Show. Hey, you know what? It's Casual Friday. It's Casual Friday here on the Fink Show. Everybody's got their oh, good. casual clothes on. Cause I'm wearing my pajamas still. Oh, good. I um, I'm wearing my pajamas as well. We'll say. Oh, good! It's a pajama uh, party. Yay! Pajama party here at the Fink Show. Let's yeah. paint each other's nails. Oh God! Get out the belt sander then. <laughs> <laughs> Get those things shaved on down. <laughs> my goodness. <laughs> Oh, man. Well, right off the top of the uh, show here, I wanted to quick give a shout out to our man Crunchy, who has Crunchy! now been Crunchy! He's now been going for two hours already on his 24 hour live charity stream. My God. You tired yet? Oh, uh, <laughs> I would be. I, I can't imagine the amount of caffeine that he has to be consuming to do that and stay upright. Um, and I can't wait to see what kind of condition he's going to be in this evening. <laughs> It's going to be a while before you're even on. Yes, it's going to be quite a while. Uh, so I'm interested to see, uh, you know, if you get a chance, tune in, of course, uh, through the day here. Of course, after us, of course. Oh, and there's Queen <laughs> J. Hello. Good Hello. morning, everyone. Hi. How are you today? I'm super. Hey, thought you couldn't join us. Hello. I, yeah, you know what? I was caught up in a, okay, just really quick Really yeah. quick story. So I I um, care for my my stepfather who <laughs> moved in like a year ago, and okay. um, he he's not like he just can't see. <laughs> he can only <laughs> okay. see like he can only see like two inches in front of him. Um, oh, so he's he's pretty no. independent. He doesn't really need a ton of help, but like he can't be by himself because if you you know if he were to fall or whatever, who would who would know? Um, anyway, so but the thing is, is he always engages me in a question right before I need to do something <laughs> and, and or like a long story. And this one happened yeah. to be a long story about someone he ran into um, and didn't recognize because he can't see really well. So, but the thing is, is he also can't hear. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, no. So, so this I'm like, fun. so whenever I'm like, I got to go right now. And he wears, you know, his, his, hey. what do you got? The, the, um, ah. uh, Right, right, right. He wears a hearing aids. And I'm like, yeah. so I gotta go, but I'll be back. He's like, so then he just continues with oh, his story. And I'm like, oh, <laughs> I gotta run. Um, so, and he can't see my visual cues of like me kind of like leaving the room. So, so he's just, just like talking to the empty room. <laughs> no, I, I, of that, Jen? I did not Jen? leave him hanging <laughs> talking to himself. No, 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 no. And, wow. and I'm probably over. Are you going to bring it. me that toilet paper, Jen? <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Three years later. He hasn't, he hasn't come out from the bathroom in a very long time. I'm starting to wonder if there's a problem. It's been three months. I keep sending food under the door, but. <laughs> <laughs> just pancakes. Like really flat it's not the only thing that will, yeah. that will work, right? The water is really hard to give them, but yeah. yeah. <laughs> Here's your orange juice. Damn it. Oh. Okay. oh. Well, see, that's a perfect segue, Queen Jay, because we have been uh, yeah. hard at work creating some new breakfast items for people. So maybe these might work. If they can fit under a door, I'm interested. I, well, yeah. <laughs> I think well, we we've actually been working on some uh, some new breakfast cereals actually, um, and so we sure I think, have yes, and but one of them weirdly enough 
uh, was <laughs> the Fink Show Queen J's Breakfast Juice, <laughs> which, I mean, good God, uh, start your day with a boost of energy. <laughs> Oh, that's me. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, exactly. I know. Right? I can hear it in her voice. She's awake. Well, yes. it's the power of espresso. <laughs> Amen to that. Well, we'll get into more of those uh, in the near future here. I just wanted to give a little teaser because we do have some pretty amazing... <laughs> ran some of these through the AI. Oh, dang. Yeah, you did. <laughs> I, I love this subject matter. I'm a huge fan of cereal. It, when yes. I grew up, that was it. I mean, well, okay, occasionally we would have some oatmeal, but mostly mm. we'd be supercharged on pure sugar in the morning. Yes. And uh, we were big, big, big fans of Lucky Charms. Mm -hmm. And then after that, it'd go Tricks and Fruity Pebbles. And, oh, and oh, wow. if we were really good, my mom would get us Crunch Berries. Oh. However, why did she not get them all the time? Because they were the same price as everything else. So I'm not sure why that was such yeah, a treat. Also, pretty much the same sugar content, too. I don't know oh, why that was. Totally. Because you kids didn't know how to act right. That's why. Apparent. Well, yeah. yeah. It's the one Three. that you wanted, so they withheld that one, right? <laughs> Three girls in one room just duking it out wow. most of the time. Um, wow. Well, we didn't have one bedroom, but we had one bathroom, and that's where we got our major fights on. Good um, God. <laughs> So, oh God, I can't yeah. imagine. Oh, you okay? So what? So my mom, my poor mom, just like would work, you know, two jobs at a time because she was a single mom. Uh, you know, after I was about nine years old, and one time my sister and I'm a peaceful person, but my middle sister was a troublemaker, and she always wanted me to fight her. She wanted me to be tough. She's like, "Fight me! Come on, come on!" And so we, we would. She would egg me on to finally like, "Fine, I'm gonna." I'm gonna start fighting you. So one time we get in this knockdown, drag out Kick your ass, total fight. So you think boys only fight? No, this was worse. It was just oh, all yeah. over, and it went from room to room. It looked like airplane. Do you remember that the fight that happened that broke out in the, the bar? <laughs> it's kind of like that. So so we're sitting here and we're dueling, and all of a sudden I throw my sister into the door to our den and the door uh -oh. breaks off the hinges <laughs> oh my god that's when everyone stops we're in trouble that's yep. when everybody <laughs> looks at each other and find we're all on the same team at that exact moment so somebody trying to break in a story yeah. right so uh so was trying to break in from inside it was so <laughs> strange we were scared mom we didn't know what to do <laughs> <laughs> so we just look at each other we're like uh, i i don't know what we're gonna do about this one so Fast forward to my mom walking in from a long day of working, you know, two jobs. It's like eight o'clock at night. She walks, she looks at the door, she sighs, and then just keeps walking. <laughs> <laughs> None of the energy. I don't want to deal I will get with you tomorrow. <laughs> All she had dead. literally no energy to even have an emotional response. Did you just yeah. prop the door up like it was supposed to be there? <laughs> yes. I mean, we, we kind of like... Were you it, just like dreading it? Like, was that even worse than her getting mad in the moment? Probably. Like, oh, the other shoe's really going to drop later? Um... Well, it added that nuance as a kid that you didn't have before. Like when you're getting yelled at, it's one thing. Yeah. But when your parent does that, you there's a mix of emotion yeah. of I've I feel so guilty right now that I just want to go <laughs> hide in a hole and what can I do to make this better? Um foreboding. So yeah, it was just yeah, it was like one of those things where you grow up and you're like, My parent is a human and oh my god, what uh. did I just do to them? Um <laughs> and I was really little too. I was like I don't know how old I was, but um, you know, my sister should have known better because my sisters are four years and eight years older than me. So that tells oh, you something. If we're wow. all still in the house, yeah. and my brother well, won that fight. I, I did. <laughs> by the way, I won that fight. <laughs> um, much. Pretty but much. yeah, it was just us girls at that point because my brothers are are ten, twelve, and fourteen years older, so they were already out of the, the house and wow. doing nothing. But um, wow. but yeah, so it was it was. It was um, the moral of the story is I'm I'm scrappy. I can... Yeah, don't don't <laughs> piss off Queen J. By the way, that's the subtext of that. But fueled by sh sugar, so bringing it on back home to <laughs> yes. cereal. Uh, this is what because my mom was working. The, mm -hmm. Our we were always stocked with at least one, if not two, cereals for our breakfast mornings, and I'm excited to see what kind of uh, well, new variations there are that I'm missing out on. We've got some good ones, and uh, just real quick about my 
a relationship with breakfast cereal. We were not allowed to have sugar cereals. Oh, dang. Uh, that was our Aww. thing growing up. And then every summer, Andy and I were allowed to pick out one of the cool cereals. <laughs> and we got one box. Cool cereals. Yeah, exactly. Like, we got to do, like, you, you know. You may have cornflakes. <laughs> yeah, right. You may have corn. Here's grape nuts. Have yeah. fun <laughs> chipping your teeth. Yes, we had that was what we were raised on. We had um we had kicks and checks. Oh, I love kicks. Kicks are great. Kicks were, kicks were yeah, I loved kicks actually. They were And they have tasty. sugar in them. I remember I eating them and going, these don't need sugar. Right. <laughs> yeah. That was the thing. And <laughs> I mean they all have I, sugar, don't they? <laughs> they do, but like there's a certain threshold or certain ones had. Oh, yeah. Apparently was according to my mom was important. Um were you those and kids re- who had to drink milk at dinner too? Um, mm. I chose to drink milk at dinner. I was <laughs> one of those people that drank a gallon of milk a day. Oh dang! Good lord! Up. Yes, I. Drank I can imagine so that you milk. and your brother a... being so tall probably yes. ate like <laughs> just. Ju- you, did your mom have to go shopping like several times a week just to get yeah. the everything yes. in there? The running like, joke. Remortgage the house. Pretty much, yeah. Well, the running joke was that there was we we were going to install a grocery loading dock so they could just put that in the garage and start loading. Get yourself your own cows. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, we would we would do um, on weekends and stuff. My mom would make like um, like a punch bowl full of eggs, scrambled eggs, and my brother and I would just eat that shit. And it was just obscene how much food we would eat. Oh my and I, god! My mom knew the dark, the the dark um, foreboding of it was when she was like, uh, "Are you guys hungry?" And the the magic phrase was, uh, "Kinda." <laughs> kinda. Because then she knew, I like, "Oh shit, <laughs> get ready!" Because we're going to, oh yeah, we're gonna chow down. So it would just be like obscene amounts of food. It was ridiculous. <laughs> I can only, I can only imagine. Yeah. I mean, you, you guys, you now tell me how many calories remind me that you oh, eat a day right now. I need, um, according to my fancy little scale that shows me like body Your fat, metabolic. And, yeah, right? it, yeah. I need 6,800 calories a day <laughs> just to maintain my weight. It's true though, because I remember when I was into, so I was really into lifting weights and bodybuilding kind of stuff when I was in my like late teens, early twenties. She'll kick your ass. Another reason and... to not fuck with me, Jay, by <laughs> Right. <the way. laughs> Or try it. Um, <laughs> You're going to be that door, motherfucker. Yeah, give, me, give me an excuse. Please give me an excuse. Um, but I was eating 4,000 calories a day. And I was oh, tiny. Yeah. So I had the kind of body shape that is like, maybe like a lot of taller people where you, you just have trouble putting on weight. So like, I was mm. just trying to not look so tiny. Um, mm. And mm. so I was so thin. In fact, it was so funny. Peep. Okay, this is a weird thing, but I want to tell it to you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I love this. Going. When I uh, when I was at, so I would work out at at twenty four hour fitness, which is yeah. also family fitness center, and I'm not yeah, sure yeah. which it was at that time. But I was so strong for my size. I looked thin, so I looked like I had like at the time I was doing some like quasi modeling, like like bathing suit stuff, right? So I, I looked it. like fit model kind of stuff or thinner. Yeah. Um, but I was warming up on the flat bench with 45s. <laughs> if that tells anyone anything about like yeah. how strong, That's but, a I warm lo- up, holy shit. but I looked tiny. So people would like gather around and watch me work out. <laughs> they'd be afraid, right? They'd be like, Miss, Oh, she need clearly help? needs a spotter. <laughs> no, they would just be like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> <What>? <laughs> they'd be like, is this like, are these foam? Are these fo- like she was like that little Hercules boy? And this is before yeah. like Instagram and stuff, where they actually people do that, where they have like fake weights and weights, and they'll do like a huge, mm-hmm. you know, personal best, but like two of them <laughs> yeah, are yeah. fake. But um, anyway, so um, yeah, so it was really kind of funny that uh, <laughs> and and now you now you know definitely don't f with me, man. Yeah, yeah I will seriously. get you. Don't Were you eating me. like twenty three hot dogs at a time? I was eating super clean. It was all super just, uh, you know, egg whites and mm. um, which you, you got to eat a lot of egg whites to make meet that chicken breast, uh, yeah. vegetables and rice. I was basically my life. Wow. At that time. Damn. Yeah. Sounds and, well, you know, I'll take lucky some chicken charms. and rice. <laughs> yeah. Right. 
Uh, we had we had a lovely salad with some vegan chicken strips last night. That was our thing. That was oh, good. I love I love all vegan foods as much as I. I'm sorry yeah. I talk about meat all the time, but no, um, I've come to because I've been a a vegan for a small amount of time, but a vegetarian for a large part of my life, like about total probably eight years of my life, I was vegetarian. Right yeah. And um, I just found so many foods that still I just prefer them. And I usually I'll gravitate towards that for for my foods. Just well, not not trying to just happens. To be, oh, yeah. this is vegan. Yeah. <laughs> like, well, like, mm, it makes sense. Honestly, <laughs> just just by the sheer numbers, you think there are what is it? Uh, was the statistic I said it was like 70,000 edible plants and there's like what like five to six edible meats out there that people really eat so it's I mean just by it's sheer choice. math yeah, yeah exactly well um, and I think too course. like if you grow your own food you get into this rhythm of what's in oh, yeah. season and then you get so excited about it yeah because yeah, you don't get it all so it's like oh my gosh the blackberries are out okay what am i going to do with these or oh, you know God, i've I got like a huge so plum tree and like oh i want to make plum tarts and you mm. know it's all about plums or oh, like oh, uh when it's grapefruit good. season you know they go in salads they go everywhere yeah. um so there's a season for everything in the garden and it kind of just gets you excited about that food more so than when or they're at the grocery thing. store and turn, you got them all year round turn, turn. oh sorry let's, um, let's sing it <laughs> I don't know. I Let's get into our 60s. BMIT Hold on. Let me grow out my BMIT. armpit hair. <laughs> oh, nice. No, I, I'll, I'll grow enough for everybody. It's fine. I've got plenty. Isn't that uh, from, but that song, aren't those lyrics from like a Bible verse? I think you may be mm -hmm. right about that. But again, like I'm not. A, I'm not Bible. But I went, I, to a, I went to a Catholic <laughs> high school. I feel right. like I should know. Holy well, both of us. Yeah, I had to do CCD. I am, uh, you know, spoiler alert, atheist. But um, yeah, the what? but I have. I know, right? <laughs> who knew? Who didn't know that? But I went through the same thing like you. I had to go through CCD, which is like Catholic training. Oh, yes, yeah, camp. Uh -huh. Yeah, and, to get confirmed. Uh, we were, you know, quote unquote Catholic. But my dad was atheist, so that obviously mm. he won in the end. <laughs> nice. No, my, my <laughs> folks, we never went to church, but uh, they wanted me to study religion. So they, they mm -hmm. uh, said, well, you should go to a Catholic high school because the public schools don't let you study religion at all. Oh. And so I was like, all right, well, yeah. So and they had great it's sports. Smart. Too. Good for yeah. them. No, I think it's good to understand the world's religions and where people mm -hmm. are coming from, because there's so many people who are. Uh, under the umbrella of Christianity, that you should know what it is they believe and know sure. generally um, where they're coming from. Well, it's that's important. the thing. It, <laughs> it's, it pays to be able to speak the language. Yes. You know what I mean? Uh, that's and that's exactly the same thing with astrology, it. even. I feel that astrology is the same way. Like, even if you don't necessarily believe in it, it 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 serves you to at least know the lingo. Sure. And know sort of the, the basic framework and stuff, because a lot of people use it same way. A lot of people believe it in the same way they believe in uh, different religions. So, yeah. Yes. Oh, yes. So I agree. So, I think it's just good to be respectful of people's, you know, like to understand where they're coming from sure. without judging. Absolutely. It, 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 that's the only thing. It generates a better sense of understanding. And that's the important thing. Um, so let's get into some of these cereals. Mm. Um, yes. Ooh, well, cereal. and so I read, I ran these through some of the AI stuff. I feel like we need some, we need some fancy commercial music here. Ooh, um, I like fancy. You know me. Oh, yes. Well, my friends, <laughs> just to get you out of the starting blocks in the morning, we have some fancy cereals from our lovely AI overlords that will soon be ruling our entire lives. Uh, first my off. My favorite background music. This is really anyway. fun. I, I love this. <laughs> yeah, you gave me this one, Quinjay, didn't you? Did you? Ah, yes, I can't, thank you. I can't remember. The cereals of uh, tomorrow. Two the cereals of tomorrow. tomorrow. <laughs> yes. Uh, so first off, the the first few um, were pretty tame. They used a lot of Fink Show references and stuff, Ooh. which was great. So there is mm -hmm. like um, Bug Bob's Breakfast Bites, a cereal for the bug loving Fink fan. Does it have real <laughs> bugs now with more I, bugs? Now with more. <laughs> <laughs> Crunchy now, June bugs. Now with beetles. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to say no because Bug Bob is a vegan, so he's probably going to have bug-shaped little well, Rice Krispies. They might have taken his likeness. And yes. Oh my gosh. Maybe they just didn't. It's not vegan because I saw. I just saw a video the other day of them making lipstick out of bugs that they scraped off of like a plant. Yes, that's oh, a carbonic acid. I saw that. That yes, carminic acid is, and that's actually something that you can find as an ingredient in a lot of things that are red colored. 
Um, and they are little carmine bugs. And they oh. are, when you squish them, they are like fire engine cherry red. It's a uh, crazy red. I had no idea because they don't, they look yeah. kind of ash, like they look like they're ashes or something stuck yeah. to something. And then when they started to crush them up, I'm like, wow, that's a, it's like a blue red though. It's a really bright, bright, yes. bright red. And they grow on a cactus, I think, if I'm not mistaken. No, they're tiny bugs. Like you can't even see them. Right. So, I mean, it's hard to feel, okay. For me, this is a personal thing, but sure, when they're sure. that tiny, it is harder to empathize with the death of these little tiny things yeah. that I can't see. No, so, I get um, Kind of like bacteria. I don't really feel bad when I squash them. Sure. No, that makes <laughs> sense. I mean, you know, we all use disinfectant. That's fair. Um, let's see. What else do we have here? We have uh, Gina's granola, a healthy Ooh. and delicious way to start your day. Oh, you know what, Gina? You are healthy and nutritious <clears throat> and wholesome. And delicious. Yeah. And delicious. Oh, true. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, wait, I got to get this other sound effect for the next one, though. Uh, uh -oh. Is it boing? <laughs> no, it's a special. It's, a, it's the equivalent for Gina here. The fake oh, show yeah. Ralph's Reese's Puffs. <gasps> Daddy. Oh, Ralph's Reese's Puffs. Sploosh. Oh, we got to turn that sploosh. It up didn't. Yeah. yeah. No I milk mean, needed. Right? Hey. <laughs> uh, wait, look. Ralph's Reese's Puffs. There we go. Yeah. A cereal for the chocolate lover and all of us. Mm. You have a shower um, sound effect? Yes. Um, well, no, it was the basement getting flooded. Here we oh. get, especially, I guess, when we have this guy. Oh, that's this. a good one. Yeah. Um, a spoon let's try that one more time. Daddy. Ralph's Reese's Puffs. <laughs> there we go. Oh, you know, you uh, need a sound bite from her. That you just, she just said a little, oh, yeah, something like, oh, me, daddy, I'll or whatever. feed you. That's a good one. <laughs> oh, make him laugh, make him breakfast. <laughs> nice how do you uh, like your egg scrambled or fertilized <laughs> jesus lord in heaven <laughs> uh here's a good one eddie's eggs and oatmeal a hearty and filling breakfast option there's no Aww, way he'd eat that i don't think no. so that's <laughs> not <laughs> happening no. come on uh john's jumbo jelly beans a fun and fruity way to start your day <laughs> That's <laughs> fruity, yeah. Wait, I want to read yes. some. Yeah, you so, read some. You read some. So wait, do you, wait? These are jelly beans. So you put them in there, and they they just don't absorb the milk, and they just kind of float. Or actually, I would they assume sink. So. They're they're almost like the marshmallows in Lucky Charms. That's the worst idea ever. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's gonna be. I don't think that's gonna fly unless okay. they unless they were inside. Do you remember? Um, they had the little shredded wheats that were stuffed with things. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah that was a thing for like a hot minute. Yes. I like the ones that had chocolate in them. <laughs> oh it. yeah, um, I there were ones that had uh, raisins in them. I think, but uh, God, way you, to ruin had, it. Yeah, well, you know. Surprise, we suck. Surprise, raisins. Like no, they, they, what if you had ones <laughs> no. with a little jelly bean on the inside? That would really ruin my teeth and yeah. pull out everyone's crowns, I guess. Well, if you didn't like it, then you could flick it away. Flick those jelly beans away, my friends. Oh, mm -hmm. <laughs> um, I'll do just that. Oh, my. Oh, my. <laughs> uh, so, Gina, you got Double some entendre those, right? morning. Yes. Come on. You got it. Kristen's Crunchy Kernels, a nutty oh, yeah. and tasty way to start your day. Oh, and you better get the one right below that since it uh, follows as, as well. Mm. Oh, me? Yeah. Farley's Frosted Flakes, a classic cereal with a fink twist. I don't know what that means. Fink twist. Oh, you know what that means, girl. I don't like to get it twist. Oh, <laughs> shit. I don't well, like to get it Oh, we're flicking our jelly bean. Yes. Oh, my. <laughs> um, and then lastly, of course, there's Queen Jay's breakfast juice. Start your day with a boost of energy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's for sure. Now, uh, qu now, Queen Jay, I sent you some other ones that yeah. uh, Gina has not heard. Yet, ah. So I wanted to see if I could spring those on Gina as well. Please. Oh yeah, we got some. We got some good ones here. Yes. Spring me. <clears throat> Are you tired of the normal waffle ball cereal? Well, now we've got nonstick carbonated waffle balls for your morning. <laughs> Stuff a couple in your mouth. Oh. Feel them. <laughs> All right. I was trying I'm, to look for so what was the word for what the carbonation does that feel their effervescence. Yes. <laughs> this is gonna, sorry, yeah, I'm yeah. making copy on the fly. Give me no, a second like here. It's the morning. Jesus. These are these are blind reads. Hey, no, um, you're doing great. <laughs> paper dinner punches, breakaway so, mini punch bowls filled with homemade cigars and foil dollar cups. Uh, <laughs> wow. 
That one's very AI, by the way. Yes. Um, this one is my favorite, so I'm bringing it out. I want to Do buy it. this. Hey, kids, are you awake? Is your tummy <laughs> rumbling? It's time for two finger bebops. <laughs> <laughs> Like what the Cindy Lopper thing? <laughs> Either that or it's one of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh yeah, cereals. I don't know what is in a two finger bebop, but I'm no, thinking you know. there's two oh, fingers. Yeah, you know. That's what I'm <laughs> talking about. Two fingers in your bebop. Hello. Hey, good morning, everybody. Are you tired of Eddie Pence's normal oatmeal and eggs? Well, now try new and improved Brain Squirrel's Oatmeal Box. It's the best oatmeal I've found that really tastes like the sour doughy oatmeal best. Oh, my God. What? Brain Squirrel? This is wrong. Brain Squirrels? These are all is so that wrong. What she said? I think it's so. It's Brain Squirrels. <laughs> it's Brain Squirrels. I think there's a song that goes with that. Brain Squirrels. <laughs> second. It's like, um, oh, oh, wait, do we need to, no. do we need to, oh, Riffin. Yeah. it's morning, what you gonna eat? It's food that your brain's gonna meet. It's brain squirrels, it's brain squirrels. It's better than their sphincters. <laughs> Buy it for me, mom. That's amazing. Yeah. No. Uh -oh. Um so Yay! on upward and onward Yay! we've got Brava. Yeah, hold on, I gotta get some cheers. It's here. really better oh. if I probably read this stuff in advance and made stuff. No. What? It's oh. not. <laughs> this no. Is I'll give so, you a sec go ahead, Jim. I'll give you go ahead, Jim. Oh, you wanna give me a second? Yeah, do you want to go? Do you want to look them over a second? Because I have Gina has a few that are based, based on. I just, oh, hello. I just oh, unhooked. Yeah. Dang it! Oh, how did that happen? Row, row, brain row squirrels. It's like yeah, I brain squirrels. It. Um, brain squirrels. Yeah, you. Brain squirrels. Oh, now Gina, you had some uh, that were based on <laughs> on some personality disorders. I do. Uh, I have. Do you, do you have any of those that? Uh, you I have antisocial flakes <laughs> for those who just don't give a damn. I'd eat those every day. I could yep. see myself eating those in my pajamas. Yeah, facing a corner though. You got back, back to the room. <laughs> you got paranoid puffs. It says mm. be vigilant against the cereal box monster. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that one would have like when you open the lid, it would have like a set of eyes on the inside of the lid. <laughs> When you opened it. <laughs> Next one is mean, but funny. <laughs> yeah, some of these are a little... We're trying not... Okay, look. Mental illness is a very serious thing, my friends. Yes. And, uh, you know, it should be treated um, very seriously. Uh, we're just having a little fun, so please don't be offended. Schizo sweeties. <laughs> the flavor of crazy in every bite. Oh, oh dude, yes. you're going down for that one. Oh. <laughs> Borderline <laughs> bites. You'll love them. You'll hate them. <laughs> oh, my God. oh, no. Narcissist Nuggets. It's all about me. <laughs> that scares me. Oh, I like obsessive crunches. Don't even think about touching my cereal. <laughs> Avoid nose. I don't need no friends. No. <laughs> um... Some of these, some of these repeat a little too, which are great, but I love them. Schizophrenic puffs. These puffed wheat cereal pieces have a creamy taste, ooh, with a hint of maniacal <laughs> laughter. <laughs> oh my god! You need the update on your AI system. It's the PC AI. <laughs> yes, the woke AI. Please. Um, let's see. What else do we have? Oh yes, here's a good one. <laughs> Oh, what did you, I heard? I heard a read that you like. Obsessive O's. These perfect <laughs> little O's will have you counting and recounting to make sure you've got them all. <laughs> it's, it probably has a number at the front, like exact number of O's oh, in the box. My God. Um, passive aggressive porridge. Oh, <laughs> this porridge is hot and cold, just like its namesake personality disorder. It's the perfect breakfast for those who want to send mixed signals. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we ate the morning after we broke the door down. <laughs> <laughs> my mom passed out some passive aggressive O's. It was oh scary. My God. Well, you know, that's how you that's how you control three kiddos. I get that. 
Well, I guess you don't need to go to college since you <laughs> yeah, <laughs> will be since living on the streets really now. Good at construction now, I guess. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <sighs> I don't know. Uh, I don't know these people. Um, we. What you got? Oh, I you, are you can <laughs> I need help with one of these? Okay, sound it out. So, what Your word. this is okay i'm so sorry to like even like i just was perplexed at the moment so much so that i needed to like ask you guys what does this mean okay, okay. this one says grandmeister cereal and it looks like it's like kind of uh, germany obviously the, oh, the font is german and the word looks you know meister is isn't mister cereal? is it meister mister or something like that grandmeister or, i don't yeah, know so it's grandmeister oh. cereal. and what is that referring to or is you that know, just one of those I'm, AI weird things? I am looking. I'm looking at it right now, and I think uh, I think the label that they try to make from it makes it look like it's Jägermeister. <gasps> oh my god! How did I miss that? Oh shit! And okay. And then yes. I, and then uh... it, the, the caption underneath it says, "For fans 21 and up, this once limited edition cereal has made a comeback." Thank you. I was I so that's... confused, and I'm so sorry for even butting in. I'm just like, what? Is, I just uh, my brain okay. broke. We're here for no, you. I'm I done like now. That. I'm done. Mic done. drop. I'm We're leaving. Proud of you. Taking that my ball, and I'm leaving. Well, let's uh, let's scroll down here on this list a little bit further. Sit with and the look sixth graders, and they'll read to you for a while. Oh my god. <laughs> oh Jesus. <laughs> uh, I've been demoted by Gina Smackdown. <laughs> <laughs> well, you both are the same person, so I'm you guys have kidding. to work that out between each other. Um, Let's look at some of these ones further down here that are made about some uh, cereals that will definitely get you out of the starting blocks in the morning. Uh, how about lithium oatmeal? <laughs> Balanced breakfast for those who need a little help getting going in the morning. <laughs> these, get, these get insane, by the way. How about meth musel? Start no, your day with musel. a bowl of this and you'll be sure to get things done. Yes, get <laughs> shit done, meth Uh Also, I can't in that same vein, I can't cocaine. sleep. I got the cleanest <laughs> house on the street. Oh, meth! Ooh, meth! <laughs> meth. Did you guys ever oh, see yeah. that PSA? Yes. <laughs> oh, are these like the the fake uh, drug commercials? Yes. Yeah. I think did, that was. Didn't that was you hilarious. have a bunch of those, or am I thinking of someone else who sent me a bunch of these like drug? I think it might have been somebody else. I mean, I would. I will have to unearth them then because they yes. were. They were amazing. I would freaking love nice. those. Um, well, speaking of speaking of drug cereals, cocaine puffs. A <laughs> delicious puffs. way to start your day with a little <laughs> extra pep in your step. Oh, I feel like I need this back now. Yes. Uh, <laughs> yes. What? Heroin helper. Start your day off right with this nutritious cereal <laughs> that will help you get through the hardest of days. Oh, shit. <laughs> And when it's not hard enough, try no Viagra loops. Yeah. <laughs> if your cereal bowl lasts for more than four hours, see a doctor. See a doctor. <laughs> I want my cereal bowl to last. Do you need to pitch it? Maybe not that long. <laughs> pitch a tent at the breakfast table. <laughs> uh, Stop PCB staring bus. at your cousin like that. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> not natural. <laughs> You know it's working when the breakfast table <laughs> raises up in your lap. Hey. <laughs> oh, you got oh. her to crack up. Gina, it's too bad I'm not at the kitchen table because you know it would come out. Oh. My my pet seals, I can't. I'll she have to had bring me into rolling. There. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I broke her the other day. It was fun. That's pretty amazing. She yeah. keeps seals, you guys. I do. I've got pet sure. seals. I will introduce you at some point, but we're not close enough to that right now. <laughs> oh, well, you know, we got to earn that. I figure that's fair. Mm. John, um, have you tried the next one on the list? Number eight. Um, oh, look at you guys see. in cahoots oh, over yes. there. Oh, I don't yes. know what number eight notes. is. I see. We're trying to spring. Oh, I thought you had these. Oh, no. Sorry. I didn't send these off to Queen J because I didn't know what the deal was. I sent you a different set of things, so we. Don't oh, know. great! Yeah, you sh you sent me the shittiest ones, and then. No, are you kidding me? That was made by like. Should put you through a door, AI. John. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna throw myself through. The door. I got orb crumpets and foam squares over here. You know what? Those are pretty strong. <laughs> I like really? It. Uh, how about uh, LSD loops? A mind-bending breakfast that will make every day an adventure. Yes. I think you I, had those at one point. I told many times. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Um, but let's scroll down a little <laughs> further. 
Uh, let's see if I can actually share these with Jen while we're talking here. Um, the uh, oof, let's see. Um, oh yeah, while you're thinking of it too. Yes, my heart yes, out's yes. seven fifteen for today. Just so you know. Oh, you got it. Okay. <laughs> Speaking Quaaludes hard, and milk. Speaking of heart out, yeah, go ahead. Quaaludes Sorry, Quaaludes and milk. And milk a, smoothie, a smooth and dreamy way to start your morning. Mm, mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm, um, mm-hmm. Yeah, like that's every mom in the 70s, pretty much. Right. Mother's little <laughs> helper in the morning. That's right. You did Tupperware and Quaaludes. That was pretty much it. Hot, yes. Sometimes you would eat the. You if you did, did enough Tupperware? Quaaludes, you're eating the Tupperware. Yes, you just right. kind of chew on it. You ever seen the Tupperware? Like where it's been gnawed at and you thought it was a dog that did it? No. No. It's mama it with the Quaaludes. Betty. Betty did yeah. it and Dolores and Agnes. They were just chewing on it. These are amazing. Oh, God. Um, what else do we have? Uh, Fruit Loops, of course. Oh, I love Fruit Loops. Yes, these beloved loops are now made out of psilocybin mushrooms. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Give you an out of this world breakfast experience. (laughs) I would, I would go for that. That's a yeah. That'll six hours of fun. Exactly. (laughs) If you need your cereal to last throughout the morning, just like Viagra loops. That's right. Um, Did those? Let me know when those make their way to (laughs) Queen J. I, I think they went through your email. Oh, you went to my email? Okay. Yeah, sorry about that. That's okay. I got the technology. Um, So let's see. What else do we have? A little further down here. um, Rice Krispies. Start your day off snapping, crackling, and popping with this new line of cereals made with ketamine for a truly unique breakfast experience (laughs) when you want to fall asleep into your bowl. (laughs) I say nay. (laughs) (laughs) That's <laughs> a nice deep cut because those are horse tranquilizers. Uh, <laughs> For the two people out there that got that. Yeah, no, no, I got that right away. Hat tip to you, Queen J. That was fantastic. <laughs> now, um, speaking of, oh my God, getting into this lower area I here. Get a little the lower, I like getting into yes. the lower area. Well, good. speaking of mm-hmm, Viagra that's what they do. here. Yes. Um, you know, if you need to have a little extra stimulation in the morning, we also have dildo O's. A perfect way to start your day. Shouldn't it be with a dildos? Extra- yes, thank you. Dildos. I, you know what? The, the AI can't dildo get it just O's. right every time. Um, but if you need a little extra something to start with your day, mm-hmm. that's the one. Yes. Uh, also, cockapops. <laughs> A phallic pleasure for your morning routine. <laughs> How, about, How about semen flakes? Oh my god. The healthy way to get your daily protein intake. A savory start to your morning. <laughs> oh my god. Unless they ate pineapple the Again, night before. milk oh, not what? necessary. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <sighs> I don't have this list. You didn't. Really? It didn't come through. It didn't come oh, through. But that's okay because I'm just gonna continue listening to your wonderful ones and making yes. up my own because my brain is weird enough. Uh, no, I like. Well, okay. how about some anal beads and rice? The ultimate oh, breakfast my... comfort food. <laughs> is that like rice pudding? I don't. I'm so confused. Oh, <laughs> that's what you'll when be you making need, when you need the so fresh sad. milk of prostate. Get some Jody just says there. no. <laughs> <laughs> She's not on board. Come on, no. Jody. Expand your horizons. Yeah. What about G Spot Crunch for mm. the woman who wants it all? Yes. Is that it's just, really wanting it all, or with just new, that? With you new know extra what I mean? ridges. Oh. I feel like this AI is also a chauvinistic male. You can't I mean, have it all, little woman. Yes. Get back in how the dare, kitchen. How dare you want it all, including the G spot? Oh my god. <laughs> um, how about? <laughs> oh my god. These are Ooh. so fucked up. Uh, dildo delight, a sweet treat for those with a penchant for penetration. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Very poetic. Thank you. How about vibrating oatmeal? <laughs> Start your day with a little buzz. <laughs> That's good. that one could be real. That's actually yeah. I, I like, like that. Kind of like that. Speaking of uh, things you could put in there, like uh, batteries, because you're going to need those batteries not included. Yes. 
Please. <laughs> Here's one idea, though, that I love. It's like, happy day candy and treats. It's fun and sweet, small puffs of real candy and treats that kids and adults can consume with a regular meal. So it's basically like it's it's a coating over your Twix bar. <laughs> oh, This is a Lord. real thing? <laughs> no, this is... Oh, right. oh, oh, the original oh. article, <laughs> the original article that uh, that John sent me. Mm. So that I, I was just uh, I was like, I, that could be real. <laughs> so sorry. Oh, I like, okay. I kind of did this weird thing where like it was a weird this pickup kind of thing. Right. The copy paste is not working, and I'm very salty about it. Um, speaking of salty, salty, uh, <laughs> Clitlicks, <laughs> a cereal that's sure to please. I don't, I don't know what ones you're licking. I mean, uh, and next, yes. How about okay? How about pussy poppers? Oh, the cereal that pops in more ways than one. Jesus Christ! And this is uh, sponsored by Nicki Minaj. She does all the commercials. Keep it breathing. Remember Mm -hmm. that taco ad where it really makes my taco pop? (laughs) Oh my god! I'm so embarrassed right now. Oh my god. What? What's the matter, Jen? These are so gnarly. <laughs> it's just it's just, it's it's just your body. It's just, I mean, it's just natural. <laughs> um I'm going to send this to all three of your email addresses. Mm-hmm. Um so let's see. What else do we have here? Um butt plug flakes. <laughs> A little something extra in your bowl. These flakes will help get you up and going. <laughs> Dude, if you got flakes down there, I think it's time to go to the doctor. A little butt dandruff for you. (laughs) Use some salve on that. Oh, salve not included. Um, (laughs) New by Kellogg's. Yes, right. Um, (laughs) Kellogg's line of... (laughs) Stop touching yourself and eat these, Kellogg's. Stop touching yourself and get into your butt. Uh, What else do we have here? Uh, for those got- who don't know, just a backup. I mean, I think everyone on this call knows. Indeed but Indeed backup. But uh, no, that Kellogg's, <laughs> that was part of their whole thing is when the, the cereal, his cereal, when it yes. was yes. invented, was a way to prevent people from masturbating. So yes. that's, what, that's where the and ship came worked. from, for those of you who are wondering. <laughs> Nobody touches themselves. And no one ever touched themselves again. Yes. Didn't that just work out great? Did you ever everybody? watch that movie, Road to Wellville? It's freaking nuts. I have not seen that. I think I did not. I Lots of famous people. That. You got Matthew Broderick. You got Anthony Hopkins. Mm. And it's all about that. It's I so nuts. That Check it out. <laughs> Sorry, Check it Anthony. Out. Yeah, we okay. We'll watch it this weekend. Um, oh, by the way, one, Gina, I watched no, our won't. movie over last weekend. <gasps> you did? I did. I rewatched it. My it's like my favorite movie. And Gina and I just sat there and quoted back and forth ridiculously history of the world part one mel brooks oh yes and oh i thought you meant you finally watched oh no Cinema the other one no no i watched our 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 favorite oh. our collective favorite movie because i I'm a love huge that movie madeline con fan i mean i'm just a huge fan of everyone in the film i love quick time hot it cooked a lot <laughs> it was just i don't know i it there were so many i mean well there's a lot of the f word use so that's um that didn't hold up but everything yeah. else yeah. totally held up and it was super super great so i loved it even that's now fantastic yeah that's what i tell you thank you Kill. well uh let's find uh another cereal here we've got uh, Clitos for the woman who likes her oh, no, we... with a side of orgasm. These O's are guaranteed to please. <laughs> but you can't have them every morning, like. Well, I mean, <laughs> it's, for the woman who wants it all, I think it's okay. You know, I'm not gonna. Okay, what about fuck you flakes? <laughs> yeah, hey, that real... sounds like a sound drop you've got there, Fink. Oh yeah, huh? Where is it? Fuck you, Fink. Why is everything? So <laughs> A cereal for those who like their breakfast with a little attitude. These fuck yeah. you flakes are going to get you going. Does Bridget fuck eat you, those flakes. every morning? Yes. She Just sure eat does. the fucking things already. <laughs> <laughs> Put it in your fucking mouth. I'll, I don't give a shit. All right, you little fucks. Come on, let's go. You, oh, you like that milk? You like that milk? I'm going to give you some more milk. I'm going to get my spoon. I'm going to get you all on one spoon. I'm going to just fucking, I'm going to eat you. I'm going to eat you all day. I'm like, well, okay, I'm not going to eat y'all, Dad. I got shit I got to do. Hurry up and get in my mouth. 
I got things to do. <laughs> I got things to do. What's in it? Shut the fuck up. Forget about it. <laughs> oh, we love Bridget. Yes, of oh. course. Jeez. <laughs> in the chat. Where are they? What aisle? I can't find the clitos. Help. <laughs> uh, yeah, a lot of men have trouble done, finding Thomas. them. Nicely done, Thomas. It's okay. Just they end up on aisle nine. You're like, no, it's 10. It's 10. Yeah, it's, no, it's 10. 10. It's, you're it's back over at nine cap. again. It's on the end cap. It's on Jesus. the end cap. Come on. It's the end cap. No, if it was the end cap, they'd find it. <laughs> oh, that's right. <laughs> it's right in your face. <laughs> Just fish around with your spoon. It'll be there. <laughs> It's, it's next to the lost hopes and dreams. Oh, it's on discount. <laughs> Dear Lord. I got a coupon here. Take this. Oh, a coupon. It's Thomas. I'm stuck in the automatic door. <laughs> <laughs> we can't help you, son. Oh, my God. Oh, He's man. on fire. Just, just the chat's on fire car, today. Yes, Seriously. Just oh man, no, JPH is gonna go help him. Yeah, I'll be JPH right there to help. help. Yeah, JPH <laughs> go help that she man. comes in like a you know like a like I was gonna say Pomp Pompier. I don't know. I was gonna say that. Sorry, wow. switch to the wrong language. She comes in <laughs> like a, a person with a fire hose, <laughs> a fire <Pompier>? person. <laughs> A fire person, this, yes. This is what happens yes. to my brain. I was working on French yesterday. Sorry, I'm in two no. languages right now. She oh, comes in. Pompier. Yeah, pompier. She comes in like yeah. a pompier with a yeah. large hose ready to help. <laughs> yes, that's <clears throat> right. God, so a sorry. Fire person. Someone put me out of my misery. <laughs> like, like Mr. Bunny Rabbit, a firefighter. Yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> yeah. There's the sexy sex music. <laughs> Oh, Thank my you. basement got flooded. This there you time. go. Sorry. I just, uh... Everybody's well, got we a crush all on love him. Mr. Except Bunny for me. It. I don't have a crush on him. No. You. Oh, man. Well, I'll take that crush then. My goodness. He's an attractive gentleman. Anyway, um, what else do we have? Nipple Nibbler O's. Oh. These O's are designed to tease and tantalize your nipples. <laughs> They're made with all natural ingredients that are sure to get you excited for breakfast. So you don't really eat them. No, you just lick them. Maybe kind of nibble on them more a of a bit. device, yes. more so than a breakfast. Yes, thing. Uh, they're they're like the appetizer, the prelude to the um, to the other things. <laughs> Everybody, everybody's mind went somewhere. <laughs> I'm like, I well I because we've that. set up like I don't know that if the rest the of you are, are like this too, but in my mind there is a grocery store now because yes. you guys set it up. And yes. we've been walking through the aisles of the I'm grocery store. In my store. mind palace, yes. It's in like mind Sherlock palace, Holmes, exactly. Mind palace. Yes. And it's JPH is at the at the uh, entrance helping our other fellow person get yes. into the store because he's stuck. I can see that. JPH, hi, can I help you find something? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's dragging him over there. She's just yes. grabbing him by the arm. Just, She's like, it's over just, here, pal. Yes, just, like, just smashes his face into <gasps> it. Like, here, here's the cereal you want. <laughs> <laughs> it's not it's not the cereal you want, it's the cereal you need. Yes, right cereal now. we all need. Oh my god. <laughs> um so we did this one already, but I like this description too. Uh this one is anal beads, the cereal that's all about giving you pleasure. Anal beads are designed with real fruit juices and crunchy granola clusters that'll make your anus tingle with pleasure. Oh. Oh, you know, I've been looking for a cereal to do that. It's a yes. tingle that lets you know it's working. Yes, who doesn't want a tingly <laughs> who doesn't want a tingly purple starfish? It tingles. Well that and on, and on that saucy note. I'm, ham donut. What, I'm gonna uh, exit and let you guys have yes. your fun this morning. Oh, okay. Love to you all. Love you. Thank we you love for you. By. I really appreciate it. You get a goodbye by. fart. You got a, so much yes, exactly. Um, so goodbye. Thanks. We're twenty one <laughs> fart You're salute. Welcome. 21 <laughs> fart salute just have like seven people fart three times it's gonna go a lot quicker oh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Please. Gonna, yeah we can't we can't do she's it said, we're, she's we're in gonna... a rush man she needs these <laughs> right farts. like fart tour get 21 people get grab your friends grab your neighbors yes, grab your dogs time. everyone and cats. everyone, <laughs> bend everyone over. fart in unison for queen J. hold everybody. hold and release oh my god <laughs> 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 All right. Very good. <laughs> you guys have a wonderful day and uh, carry on. Thank so thanks carry for playing. On. Laters. Later, taters. Bye, later. Later, taters.
Oh, that was a good one. Oh, wow. Well, that was that was awesome and unexpected. And thank you, Queen J, for stopping in. Yeah, she was here a good long while. I, didn't, I know. I didn't I know she was coming. I, uh, I knew she was going to stop by for a little bit, but I didn't know. Nice. So this is cool. Um, yay. Awesome. Well, uh, Gina Wells, what other things have you seen in here that looks good? I like the one that says Sex Toy Surprise, a cereal that's full of surprises. Each box comes with a different sex toy hidden inside. <laughs> it's like a Cracker Jack box, I mean, you know, you just get like an extra an extra I, little fun thing in there. I really like this one. Pussy popcorn. <laughs> a sweet and savory cereal that's designed to resemble popcorn, but tastes like pussy instead. Oh my god. Pussy popcorn is made with all natural ingredients and is sure to get you excited for breakfast. <laughs> Jesus God! So is it cereal or is it popcorn? I think it's a cereal. Okay, so it, no, it says it's a sweet and savory cereal that's designed to resemble popcorn. So it's supposed to look oh, like popcorn. So it just looks like popcorn, but it tastes like pussy. Mm. I'll pass. Yeah. Wow. Um, did I ever tell you I really don't like popcorn? Is that it? Is that something? No, I don't think you did. Uh, yeah, I... Oh, wait, yeah, yeah. We said yeah, your dentist yeah. must love you because you never get it stuck in your teeth. Yes, I cannot, <laughs> I cannot talk, I, I cannot talk, I cannot stand uh, the popcorn skins that get in between my teeth or get in between my tooth and gum. Yeah. It's so upsetting to me that I have now sworn off popcorn. No, I get it. I just do not like it. Do not like I it. I had one slide down in between the gum. Oh. And uh, the, the, the gum swelled up. Over, oh, like, over the tooth. Oh, God. So I went to the dentist and he's like, oh, you need a root canal. Oh, so I went that. to the endodontist and he's like, no, you got something stuck in here. And he and he dislodged it. I How was did like, that well, thanks, Dennis, for not the, giving you know, a shit. Right. Oh, it felt amazing after. <laughs> did you? Were you just like, oh, that's <laughs> I don't I don't know about that. <laughs> I mean, I would, but <laughs> it was a hot endodontist, though. Oh, well, there we that go. Was, that was nice. <laughs> oh, oh my oh my anything else you want to dislodge from me sir um, <laughs> oh my um what else do we have here we've got a cocktail sausage a mm. sausage shaped cereal that's designed to look like a mini cock cocktail oh. sausage is made with all natural ingredients and is be sh and is sure to get you excited for breakfast okay that one i'm in on <laughs> hey like why they, don't you eat a bowl like, full of dicks don't mind if i do <laughs> <laughs> Tastes like little Vienna sausages. <laughs> <laughs> JPH, gimme, gimme. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Oh, Jesus. I am like sweating from this one. Um, <laughs> all right. So we got a couple left and then we'll yes. get into our free skate time. Any, yes. Would you have a preference for those? I, I like, the, I like the bottom one. Okay. I'll take the next one then. God, I can't believe it. these are coming. Words are coming out of my mouth. <laughs> Ball sack bites, a cereal that's all about giving you pleasure. Ball sack bites are made with real fruit juices and crunchy <laughs> granola clusters that'll make your balls tingle with pleasure. Real fruit juices. Why fruit juices? I don't know. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> <laughs> those those would be definitely, and the uh, the extra large size would be for Ralph. JPH, they burst in your mouth. <laughs> They're like fruit gushers. <laughs> that was excellent. Oh my god. Well okay, done. Okay, the JPH. last Holy one. Shit. Yes. Rim job rations. A cereal that's all about giving you pleasure. Rim job rations are made with real fruit juices and crunchy canola custards. <laughs> That'll make your anus tingle with pleasure. Sometimes oh AI god. just kind of copy paste. <laughs> Yeah, sometimes they they definitely repeat themselves a few times, but damn! I don't even think we got into our uh, Olympics that go with we the cereals. We didn't. We were we were <laughs> have to save it. We were, yes, we're gonna we're gonna get into the Olympic stuff later on. Maybe you know what? We'll save that for Monday because Marcus is a big fan of the Olympics. So we'll see if Marcus. Has All right, it. sir. That's a good idea. We were just John and I on our own. We're going back and forth about what should be an Olympic event compared yes. to what is an olympic event yes we were just having a ball and then did yeah, you run yeah. it through the ai as well not yet oh I'm okay going to. i'm going okay to. so 
And also, if anybody's got some ideas for sort of these uh, mundane new Olympic sports, I think Please. what inspired us is we uh, – I was sharing a video with Gina about the new Olympic sport, which is horse dancing. Um, I didn't know if that one was Olympic or not, but it definitely is an official sport. It's definitely an official sport now where they have a horse on a rope going around in circles. And this woman is like vaulting on and off of this horse. And they're, it's you know, just dancing, on judges, horse. dancing on her horse, jumping on and off. Uh, and it's uh, scored just like any kind of gymnastic sport. And so we were like, what is, why is this a sport now? <laughs> and so um, we got some ideas uh, and uh, we'll, we'll go over some of those on Monday. But if you have some ideas, of course, you can call into the show, my friends, and give us your own ideas of Monday and Olympic sports. Let's give them the phone number, Gina Wells, since we haven't Please. done that yet. Tell me what you think. Call Big Fink. 774 Big Fink. Gina, did you turn off your phone? Oh, Hello? Gina. Oh. No, she was dancing on the horse. Oh. I know. Okay, Gina, I got to go by. Yeah, okay. Sorry. Uh, it's okay. Um, yes, I just want to so tease the one that I came up with. Yes, For please. Monday. Yes. Was, you know how they have the run walking? The, yes. the That literally is a sport. Walking. I said speed walking. I said, John, it should be full contact. Then I'll be in. Yes. Full contact speed walking. Bashing each other with elbows. (laughs) I was saying uh, other things like Olympic bar, like Olympic Jenga, you know, with the giant Jenga. (laughs) The giant one. Yeah. That you do outside. The giant one. Yes. (laughs) Um, And if you, if you lose, you have to allow the Jenga tower to fall on you. I think is the. (laughs) Or strip Jenga. Strip Jenga, yes. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes. Uh, so yeah, if you have some ideas for let some other mon- mundane Olympic sports, let us know. We'll get those into the rotation here, um, and we'll uh, talk to the we'll talk about those with Marcus, who is a big big fan of the Olympics, and we'll give him a little runway. Oh, I didn't that. know that. Oh yes, yeah. Marcus loves the Olympics. Um, also, uh, like we said at the top of the show, make sure to tune in to Crunchy's 24 hour live stream. I will be on there at uh, 7 p.m. Pacific doing some fuser er, er, DJing. Um, er, 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 and uh, we'll see if I can put some other little Fink show drops in there. Um, like when I've, you know, overstayed my welcome with a certain song. It is all right. You know, and then um, maybe if I maybe if I slip something weird in there, I could be like sneaky turtle. Jesus, I gotta level that one down. Um, Or like something really good, you know. So thanks for that. (laughs) And then of course, because we are going not only nationwide but worldwide, we could also say to the nation, West Coast, (laughs) East Coast. (laughs) Thank you, Dweezer Who. Hey lady. Uh, hey lady. Your music's beautiful. Hey lady. You look beautiful. That's oh, right. Thanks, Dweister. Oh, Dweister loves you. Um, and then of course Uzi in your face when you open up the door for Stop. your hashis. Stop putting your pussy in my face. I don't know. He wants to give you that before he gets well, maybe he wanted to give you some pussy popcorn. Oh, thanks, Dweister. Yeah, Dweister Dweister is all about sharing, so <laughs> Um, you know, he's a, he's a, <laughs> he's a magnanimous gentleman. That's, That's right. Big. That's right. Oh, oh so, Thank you. um, yes. Well, stay tuned for that this evening and, um, we'll have other wackiness coming along here. So. <laughs> right. <laughs> uh, but in the meantime, my lovely let's friends, talk to our friends, yes, let's talk to our friends here. If you're a Patreon subscriber, put your skates on. Yes, put your skates on. Come on into the free skate. And We're going to have custom skates subscriber. made for you, John. Yes, it's just two skateboards <laughs> bolted to some <laughs> bolted to some shoes uh, just so I can skate around with everyone, too. Um, shout out to my... I, I have another Brit friend, Ian, not the Ian Strang that we know, but another friend, Ian, who went to this crazy roller disco thing and Madonna was there. He was like roller skating alongside the hell? Madonna and he sent me a video. It was the weirdest, weirdest Like recently? Shit. Yes. Oh, wow. It was very strange. And um, I so know, prop- I'm Madonna. To- yeah, exactly. So props to, uh, it was Ian Twin out Perfect there. Perfect impression. 
Yes, yes, spot on, spot on. Um, but uh, yeah, so if you if you got your roller skates and you're out on the Patreon, I see Steve coming in. Show. Oh yes, we've got Steve coming in. We got Bug Bob coming in here. Uh, What's yes. up, Steve? Does the sound not work? Nope. No, you do there I, now. Buddy. I hear you. Oh, okay. What's up, man? Hey. Oh, there we go. We'll do that. Hey. Did you have a favorite crazy. cereal? Yes. Ooh, I don't know. I think the that was that the don't give a fuck flakes or something like that. <laughs> that was, that was fuck strong. You, fuck you flakes. Fuck you flakes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Fuck you yeah. flakes. Yeah. A cereal who, for those who like their breakfast with a little attitude. <laughs> don't give a fuck flakes. Attitude. Attitude. Hi, Bug Bob. Hello, Bug Bob. Hey, good morning. How is everybody? Doing great. Well. Excited for the uh, start of the weekend here. Uh, mm. I'll be tuning in to uh, see what Crunchy's up to after this and s- on his little Twitch stream. Uh, what you got planned uh, for this weekend, Bug Bob? Any cool bug collecting stuff going on? Um, well, just the usual stuff. You know, setting up black lights, see what comes in, photograph. Usual stuff. Oh, cool. <clears throat> so, that is... That's amazing that that's your usual stuff. I like that. That's I've been doing it my whole life, so it's you know it's like putting on socks, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so so cool, man. All right, and then I'm heading up Steve's way. Oh, I'm gonna go over. My friend owns uh, a photography store in Torrance, and I'm gonna drop by there today. Oh, and then uh, there's a Target in Carson nearby. I know, totally exciting, huh? They hey, are. Right. Target. Target's well. Target's got this incredible Hawaiian shirt with monarch butterflies all over it. Oh, you gotta oh, get that. Yeah, man, you and gotta get that. They they don't. It, they're selling out. They they don't sell it online or deliver it. You have to go to the store, and they won't reserve it for you. And you can't Carson do the pickup even. Oh Same. man, you can't do pickup. No, they won't oh, let wow. you do anything online because they're. There, it was a, a quick deal. I saw one. I saw some woman walking by with one. I said, "Oh my gosh, where'd you get that?" And she said, <laughs> "She's like, ah, oh, get away from me." <laughs> she told me the same thing that I just told you, and she said, "But you got to get it now." There's they, they only made a limited run, mm. and it's a great shirt. Well, good luck to you, sir. So I, I went up get... there and do that. That's exciting. And please, please post a picture on the Fink Show yes. page if you get yeah, it. We'd love to see that. you in it. I hope I get it. It's I hope beautiful. God, I too. hope I get it. <laughs> I know. Do, 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 do. Wait a minute. That's for my... Hey, That's I have a... an Olympic event. Oh, yes. Sure. We'll call it crowd splitting. And so... <laughs> <laughs> I know this one. Yeah, you do. I yeah, think you, you meddled in this. There you go. Yeah. So you take the contestants to Comic-Con San Diego. Yes. That's right, and baby. And send them loose. And whoever whoever makes it to the convention center through that incredible crowd, by the way, people that never been, there's like 140,000 people there. Yes. So it's a serious crowd. And see who I makes would, it to the convention center first. I would love that. I, like and I would also love to see like a, a point to point race from one end of the show floor to the other. Oh, uh, I like, like that. A, one too. Like a speed walking thing through the crowd. Yeah, like you're not allowed to run. No, you have to walk because they will they'll take you down the security people if you run there. And also oh, really? it's, it's literally impossible to run in that. It's just you'll you'll you like knock people over and then they'll be like, Hey, you guys will get out of here. But if you <laughs> if you could like weave your way through the crowd and like crowd split essentially, yeah. Um I would I would watch that. And you could watch it from the mezzanine level. Like all the yeah. all the spectators could watch it from that little secret middle level with the big window. Oh, mm-hmm. I and you get like that. an autograph of your choice as the prize. Hot Ooh. damn. <laughs> you know, awesome. the Comic Con games. The Comic Con games. <laughs> Actually, that's not a bad idea at all. I'm surprised like G4 didn't do that or something. That would yeah. be a great idea. Like the Attack of the Show guys. <laughs> right. Yeah, that, that would be amazing. Oh, and then somebody. Okay. okay, good. Thank you. Someone in the chat mentioned uh, something about a D-bag firefighter, and I said, oh, I have a story that I'd like to tell real quickly. Yes, uh, tell yeah, us. That was me. Okay. I used to work for the county health department, eight mm. freaking horrible years. Anyway, um, yeah, thank you, uh, 1980s and early 90s, for having a terrible economy. And so <laughs> making people get stuck in crap jobs for a long time. Yeah. So anyway, 
The brother of one of my coworkers is a firefighter up in LA and he himself's kind of a jerk. So he's at his firehouse and they all bought lot lottery got really big and they all bought lottery tickets. So the, the guy, so one morning they all wake up, you know, cause that's how their shifts go. They wake up in the firehouse and someone posted all the numbers. They put them on a whiteboard. And so, my coworker's brother looks at his numbers and goes, oh my God, I won. And he proceeded to go face to face with everybody in the fire station and tell them all. Oh. Yep. He, and he then when the... he was done, when he was Please tell me he was they wrong. All said, they all said, guess what? You didn't win. We looked at your numbers and wrote them on the board. Oh, beautiful. And, so and now we that, hate you. Exactly. And so it was so bad that That's the awesome. the fire department, the whole, whatever they call their administration, had to transfer him to a different station. Oh, oh man. my God. <laughs> That's <laughs> amazing. Well, more proof that money does fucked up things to people. Damn. It really does. Yeah. Wow. Oh, my God. That's almost like that uh, scene from Half Baked where he's like, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. You're cool. I'm You're out. Cool. Throws the hammer at the fuck you. Thing. <laughs> You're cool. <laughs> it's like that one old dude like, yeah, yeah, I am cool. <laughs> <laughs> I still quote that. <laughs> You're cool. You're cool. <laughs> fuck you, I'm, I'm out. <laughs> I, I do love that one. That's pretty amazing. Oh, my God. Wow, dude. Well, you know, you got to watch. And I've seen ones, too, where they did the the fake lottery tickets. Oh, sure. They, and I saw the one where the guy pranked his wife and she fainted Aww. and like, oh like fell and like, all, like almost hurt herself, like knocking her head on the counter fainting because she th he told her that she won and he was like reading off the numbers on it. So I want to divorce your honor. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Irreconcilable differences right here. <laughs> Yikes. Oh Very my good. Thank you, Bug Bob. Thank you, Bug Bob. Oh my God. What a show today. Let's call it a show, right? Show. show. Oh, good. Thank you. Show. All right. Show. Oh, uh, what about a fun it. day. What's that now? I had to think about it. Yeah, we had, no, we had to make sure we wanted to call it a show. You know? <laughs> gotta, does it feel showy? Does it feel showy enough? I like it. it feels, There's you know, no need to think. You're with John Fink. Oh, hey, look this at this guy, guy over here, over there. So good. So good. I love it. That should be on a t-shirt. I love it. All it, it right, could my love. Be. Yeah. It could be. That's right. That's right. But uh, stay tuned Monday, my friends. We'll have some more wacky times, right? Gina Wells, what about them horses? Horse last. Yeah, baby. Later, taters. Fuck you, Fink. Later, taters. Yeah.